Live in Rio Rancho, where firefighters had a long night battling those flames. Alyssa. Yeah, Ron, well, last night this area was filled with smoke, but today it's looking much better. Fire crews say here in the Bosque, hotspots can get out of hand very quickly, but this isn't the first time someone has purposely set it on fire. Around 6 Sunday night, the Rio Rancho Fire Department got a call about a fire in the Bosque. When they arrived, they found several fires they believe were set intentionally. There was a, a total of five separate fires that were burning simultaneously um, over the course of about eight acres of, of the Bosque. About six fire agencies worked to put out the flames. One neighbor says he couldn't believe a fire was happening right behind his house. Uh, the, the smoke was actually quite thick. And then, uh, and then when we went to, uh, to bed last night, uh, all you, all you did was smell smoke. Edwin Johnson capturing these pictures of the flames. The conclusion just talking with my neighbors was somebody had to have uh, started that fire. So, I mean, and it, uh, to, to, uh, to, to realize that, that was such a, you know, uh, shocking realization. Uh, just to, to think that somebody would actually start that fire. But that also happened in 2003, the two fires lasting almost a week, forcing 600 people out of their homes and burning more than 260 acres. Investigators blamed those fires on two teenagers playing with fireworks in a homeless camp. When they shoot off the fireworks, yes, uh, it, it puts out the, the beautiful display in the sky, but as it falls to the ground, it is a burning ember. And when it falls into a pile of leaves or, or dead and, and down trees, uh, it'll smolder. And Fire chief says crews were out until 2 a.m. putting the fires out the burned debris left behind. Well, the crews will be out here for the next few hours to make sure the fire is out and the Rio Rancho police say there are currently no suspects. Reporting in Rio Rancho, I'm Melissa Munoz, KWT Action 7 News. Melissa, thank you. The fire chief says no burnings allowed today since it's a red flag day in the Albuquerque area as well as western and central New Mexico. <laughs>